Hey everybody, it's Leslie Harmon from Allergy Wired and a little video for you this week about the EpiPen. And I have an EpiPen trainer here in front of me. I've never actually fired off a real EpiPen before, but I'm going to do that today. So uh, hopefully you don't witness me stabbing myself accidentally with an expired EpiPen. Even though it's expired, I'm sure we'd suck to the emergency room. Uh, EpiPen trainer. This is an epinephrine device for emergency allergic reactions such as to bee sting, latex, peanut, and if this were a real one, I wouldn't be using it to take off my fingers like this because it's got a needle in it that I think is about that long and it would stab right through. Number one, pull off gray safety release. Number two, jab black tip firmly into outer thigh so it clicks and hold on thigh approximately 10 seconds. I don't know if you heard that click, but I had to push it in hard enough that it feels like I'm going to get a bruise. Now, if I were really administering this to myself or to someone else, I would be counting to 10, slowly, 1 Mississippi, 2 Mississippi, etc., until it got to 10. And that's all you do. That's all you do. Go straight to the emergency room, administer Benadryl or other antihistamine, whatever your action plan is, you follow that. Okay. So now I'm going to try to do this to the tomato for the neighbor turns on it. One more. Yeah. Okay, hey, I'm, I'm just let's put it right down here. Right here. That way you can see the. That was a loud click. And I held it on there to about the count of 10 mentally. Oh, yeah. It's not quite as big a needle as I thought it was. There it is, and you can see it's still got some juice in it. All right. So you knew those unused tomatoes were good for something. If you have any questions, you can contact me at allergywear, A-L-L-E-R-G-Y-W-A-R-E, gmail.com. Visit the website, allergywear.com. Thanks.